Morning guys. So today I'm going to prove yet again that you can run a UZ engine on the standard computer. So this week I was told you can't run a 1UZ VVTi on a standard computer. Yet I do it. And I'm not the only one. And I was told you can't run a 3UZ on a standard computer. So in front of me I have a 3UZ. Um, you can tell the difference between a 1UZ VVTi and a 3UZ by the size of the breather. So the 3UZ has the bigger half inch, the 1UZ has the smaller one. Full drive-by-wire throttle body, so there's no cable. So the 1UZ VVTi looks like this. And yes, it's drive-by-wire, even though it's got a cable. As you can see, I can move it that far, and nothing happens on the throttle body, on the butterfly. And it's only that last little bit. 3UZ also has an idler, but of course that can be changed. Different oil filter housing. And different exhaust manifolds. More log type, like the old Crown. Same coils as the later model 1UZ VVTi. <coughs> different filler. Different dipstick. Normally a different sum, but this one's been changed. So here I have a setup. The computer on this one is uh, 89661-50590, which is 3UZ. I've wired it as an automatic. So that's going to be the shifter that I'm using. I've used this relay set. The kit's going to come with a CND unit for the dash and a fan switch and this pedal. It didn't come with the factory pedal, so I've put this pedal on. When you first fire it up, the throttle body won't do anything until it sees some pedal action and away it goes. So I haven't fired this one up this morning. We'll see if we can make some noise. I think it's the orange wire. Let's have a go. It is cold. It is running on a stand. Here we go again. There we have it. That was the first fire up of the morning, so it was a little bit, a little bit funny. But once it's in a, in a vehicle and running, it's going to run just fine. So this is the kit set I've made up for a, for a customer. It's uh, going to go in a box now. But there you go, 3UZ engine running on a 3UZ computer. <laughs>